So what do we have here today? We have the 1.11 firmware for Behringer Wing. So this new firmware comes with the three new plugins, which is very interesting, especially on the speaker manager. So let's check it out on the three new plugin for this 1.11. Okay, let's go have a look. We go to the main one. So I have assigned the new speaker manager plugin to this uh, main output. So we can find this on the standard effect. The speaker manager is here. Okay. And then for the another two plugin, which is the triple DEQ. So this is a triple EQ. Triple this is the triple DEQ. So basically it's one, two, three. That's all about it. And this DEQ is similar to this dynamic EQ of this uh, speaker manager. Okay. And the third plugin is a well-word imager, which actually is for uh, left and right imaging. So that's about it. But what most interests me is this speaker management. And we shall explore further on this speaker manager. So basically, this is the filter of the speaker management. So we have this Butterworth, finally, from 6 dB octave to 48 dB octave. Nice. So let's try with high pass and the big noise. Working well. Flat and a low pass. Working very, very well. So we have the face, a fine tune or just a inward. And then we have a precision delay up to 5 meter. And then we have a position. We have a position to align the left and right speakers. So this will need further testing. And then we have dynamic EQs. So basically, this is what we can set the threshold. If let's say the signal is more than the threshold, and then we can either set the gain, go higher, or reduce the gain. So for example, we have here, let's say we turn on a dynamic EQ, which if the signal is below this 52 dB, then there's no deduction here. Only when the signal, I when I push this uh, volume higher, the ping noise higher, and then there's a reduction of dB, like this. And here is the limiter. We can set the threshold and the release time. So we can choose either the measuring is from RMS or peak and whether turn on or turn off. So let's turn on it. And we set the threshold to the minimum so we can uh, listen to it. And now I'm bringing up my volume of the ping noise. And you should be able to listen to the uh, gain suppression uh, or the gain limiting. Now I'm turning up my volume again. And if I turn off this limiter, turn off this limiter, it is working very well.